I'm Brian Cooley from CNET on Cars, taking some of your email about high-tech cars and modern driving. This one comes in from Jonathan B. in Valendar, Germany, who says his question is about the aim of self-driving cars in general. Is it really to be safer? He says there will always be other cars that aren't automated and are being driven by humans, thus exposing the rest of us in self-driving cars to the same accident risk, he reasons. Uh, now, Jonathan, it's an interesting question because this is often seen as an all or nothing position, but let's really dig into it here, into this idea of reducing accidents with self-driving. First of all, there are the intercar benefits. So this is the area of cars dealing with each other. And I would posit to you that getting even a fair amount of self-driving cars on the road is going to increase our safety, even though we have a lot of humans still driving around those cars. The self-driving car will see the human-driven car around it as just another obstacle to be recognized, processed, and dealt with with its various machine reactions. Now, it's not perfect, of course, but I don't think we need to get to an all-or-nothing fleet for self-driving cars to be extremely safe. Then there's also the intra-car benefit, how self-driving cars, regardless of how they act with other cars, will help us get rid of the problems we have from drunkenness, distraction, and just plain crappy driving technique that, let's face it, plagues so many folks who are driving their cars right now. The third area of benefit is going to be kind of the, the group or the hive mind benefit. Deep in the future, when self-driving cars are talking to each other, are all reporting in as a group to some kind of central control within a metropolitan area, and we can really manage the cars out there as a fleet, making sure every car is doing the right thing in relation to the roads and the cars and traffic conditions and flow, as opposed to the kind of willy-nilly haphazard driving and decisions that we make today. But that's well down the road, and that benefits both safety and, of course, efficiency.